watch out Better not cry Better not pout I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming to town Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, as you can see by the title, it is going to be a home bargains haul. I'm super excited to show you guys this. I've got the odd few Christmas bits as well as quite a few cleaning products. You all seem to really like this video last time that I did it, so I thought it'd be a good idea to do another. Also, I look a little bit different. I have been trying out a few different products and a few different looks as the next video I'm going to be uploading is going to be a holiday glam look. Um, so I'm just trying to get a little bit festive. You know, it's now December. So I thought it'd be a nice idea to do a little bit of a seasoned makeup tutorial. So this is one example of what it could look like um but i'm still gonna have a play around and see which other products i like and which one will give you the best results on what i think so yes without further ado we are going to get straight into the video okay so the first thing i'm going to show you is in the christmas little bundle that i've got for you guys i feel like this year home bargains has upped its game for christmas like we're talking john lewis standards and like ideas and quality like they have just done it down to the t this year so um i already had a lot of decorations uh, from last year as i did buy quite a few new bits um but i thought i would just get a few little bit extras because who can go into home bargains and not buy anything <laughs> not me so these are the first thing i am going to show you guys like can we just take a moment how stunning are these christmas trees um i saw these on a shelf they obviously come in two sizes as you can see um they are just a hollow um christmas tree um but these are just absolutely stunning so i think the small one was about 2.99 and the big one was like 3.99 or 4.99 um these go and sit on my fire guard which is right here um i have taken the labels off these because the second that i got home the other day i ripped the tags off and put it on um i got a little bit too overexcited. um but i had to come on and show you guys these because i think they are absolutely gorgeous so next thing i bought was just the usual christmas cards um i buy different for like family members so like my dad and my mom they all get like proper like named christmas cards um but for like friends and like more distant family or neighbors i just buy normal christmas cards i thought these were really really cute these were only 99p for 10 and that is what they look like so i thought they were really really pretty so i picked some of those up then i picked up uh, three things for lily for christmas um, Lily at the minute is very much into Frozen, she's into hair, she's into nails, she's into makeup. I think because I do mine, that's kind of how she started to pick things up. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of trying to grow up too quick, I'll put it that way. Plus she's blonde, so Elsa at the minute, she's like, I am Elsa, I've got Elsa hair. I'm a princess, get over it. That is kind of like her attitude at the minute. So um, I picked up three things for her. These are just going to be really nice, cheaper presents. You know, when, if you're stuck for buying your children anything, please head down there because you know what they're like. They rip everything up, they ruin everything. You know, they drop it, they smash it and things like that. So sometimes you don't want to spend so much because it's probably not going to stay in the condition that you bought it. So Home Bargains is definitely a place to go and check out. So I bought her this. This is the Frozen 2 Jigsaw Puzzle. comes with 42 pieces from the ages of 3 and up. And I just thought it looked like a really fun thing for her to do. She loves anything like puzzles as well. Um, she's a very interactive and interested kid. She loves solving things and all things like that. So I thought that would be really nice for her. Plus it's Frozen obviously then i picked up this which is the super coloring obviously frozen edition this was 199 i think the jigsaw puzzle was like two pound two pound something something like that um so it's just a coloring book activity book it's got all the different things in it she loves stickers 
me and stickers have a complicated relationship let's just put it that way especially when they found them down the side of your couch and stuck to the bottom of your shoes so yes um so i thought this would be really really nice for her it's got so many different scenes in it you know she isn't going to color in the lines the girl don't give a crap about that but you know it's all pictures that she can relate to it's all things all the characters that she knows and loves so i thought that would be really really fun for her last thing whilst my child is getting into um beauty and everything like that um she has asked for certain things um like a hair dryer and a mirror and things like that um so i thought this would be a fabulous little gift it is all plastic it has straighteners curling tongs rollers hair dryer mirror brush clips how actually adorable is that and i swear this was about 3.99 um so this is going to be great for her to have a play around with um and i saw it and i just had to get it because i thought it saves her trying to mull through my drawers so yeah i picked this up for her which i am so excited to see her face on christmas morning because i know for a fact she's absolutely going to love this okay so the next thing we're going to move on to is cleaning products there is a hella a lot of cleaning products i'm not going to lie to you guys i have a full-on asda bag full of stuff so i'm just going to start randomly pulling stuff out and we'll see where we go okay so first thing i've got okay bit of toilet gel always need it it's about 69p does the job love it next two things oh jeez lord almighty i got some flash bathroom cleaner i bought a bit more of this really like this stuff i love the smell of it love how it cleans everything so i picked some more of that up i then got some of the flash bleach spray for if i ever want to do a bit more of a inner deeper clean um yeah it does stink of bleach if you don't like the smell of bleach you're not gonna like this but i don't mind it love it next thing i picked up was some fabulosa Oh, it looks like I picked up quite a few Fabulosa. <laughs> Great. Um, where does all your money go? Home bargains. Yay. So I picked up three Fabulosas. Um, these, if you don't know what this is, this is basically um, as a flora, but a little bit cheaper. So flora do a bit more perfumed, classical scents. I'm really trying not to slag the, like fabulosa off because there's nothing to slag off but the scents are just very different i'll just say that um but they still smell incredible so i picked up this one which is wild rhubarb this is one of my favorites i have this in the spray form as well but i like to do these and then refill them so i don't have to keep going out buying everything um i then bought spring blossom which i've not tried yet which i'm very very excited to try and unicorn dust is also another one of my favorites um so I can't wait to use this. I also have this one in the spray form as well. Um, I then picked up a, another Nutridol carpet deodorizer in the pink. I prefer this one over any of the other scents that they do. Um, and the Glade ones are also very nice, but I just picked up one of these. These were 99p. And the Fabulosa is also 99p, so there is a tiny bit of a price difference between that and the Flora. Next, I picked up some of this. This is the Wiz Anti Back Laundry Cleanser. Simply add to your wash. So I like to put a cap full of this in things like Lily's nursery clothes, or if you've ever been to the park or anywhere like that. It just kills off all the extra bacteria. And with times like this, what we're going through currently, you know, you have to take every precaution that you can. That's not me being a germaphobe, but I just think, especially in winter when there's so many different things going around, we don't want to get ill. It's always good to take care. And I swear this is about a pound as well, so it's not breaking the bank either. Next thing we have, my little tea lights. Um, I am an obsessor over tea lights. Um, I have a pack of 25 of the eight hour ones. So they are the thicker based tea lights. Um, as I do have some taller wax melts um, or wax burners so the little ones sometimes don't make it burn as much whereas the big ones because they're a bit higher it reaches it better so these were about £1.50 
don't quote me on that it's something around there so i just picked up two packs of those and i picked up a pack of 30 of the normal standard size tea lights uh this time of year i am obsessed with anything like candles and wax burners um and the sizzlers and everything like that i think it just makes the co the home so cozy and i love it so i always need to restock on tea lights okay next thing that is in my bag razors yeah as i said in my tanning video if you've not watched it please go check it out i buy any razor they had these these were a pound bought them story over um i bought another bleach um this was 39p it's always good just to have bleach on hand as i do seem to go through it quite a bit um so for 39p you cannot complain um i then have some reusable well it's not reusable it says refuse sacks not reuse so i bought some bin bags um you know i think again it's like if i feel like this time of year the bins get full up so quickly so i have to go and like restock on loads of things um but i'm a bugger for changing my bins quite a bit um i don't like food in the bin bit of a pet peeve of mine i don't know why i don't ask but i'm always changing the bin so i always need bin liners so i got some of those um i then picked up one of the fabulosa sprays this is in the unicorn dust so i'll either soak things like cloths and things in this to help disinfectant it or when this runs out i will then top it up with this um it does tell you how to do everything um with regards to doing things like that so that's always good um i then picked up uh another washing up liquid um i always go through a load of this and also lily likes to pretend to wash up um as well in the sink and i always have to use this so this we go through like wildfire so i always have to be stuck on this and then the last thing that is in my bag is soda crystals if you guys don't know what soda crystals can be used for it says everything on the front they can be used as laundry aid they can be used as a multi-purpose cleaner i intend to use this for my sinks i pour cut off the corner pour some down the sink and then i get a bottle of white vinegar and pour it in and watch it all fizz up it just helps keep the drains clear unsmelling and everything like that so this is always a must-have for me as well um i do my sinks one or two times a week depending but yes so i'm really sorry there wasn't really a lot of interesting things in that but i know that you guys said that you do like to see these kinds of videos so i thought whilst they've been i will show you i hope that you have enjoyed this video any other video requests please leave a comment down below and please like and subscribe and yeah I always get really confused on this part because I don't know what else to say. Um, but no, thank you so much for the love and support so far. I hope you all have a lovely rest of your week. And there will be another video coming on Sunday. So enjoy and I'll see you all soon. Bye guys.